Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing our Cottage Living Rags to Riches Let's Play. Very excited to get back into this. There is like 90% of the pack that we haven't even explored yet. So I'm just excited to see what it has to offer. I hope that you guys are having so much fun playing it. The past two streams that I've done on Twitch, we have given the Cottage Living Townies a makeover. So yeah, it'll be exciting to see them out and about. The only issue was once I like moved them to my plate households, they were replaced with another one like for example the creature keeper we gave him a makeover but then like since he was moved into our plate our plate household there was a different creature keeper that took his place so i unplayed the household so hopefully he will be back as the creature keeper fingers crossed i hope i didn't mess everything up by freaking giving them makeovers <laughs> but yeah i'm hoping today that we can make more trees for our cow hopefully get some more animals and hopefully our oversized crops will finally grow because they're really taking a long time thank you guys so much for your comments and feedback on the last couple of episodes i'm so glad that i'm so glad that you guys are enjoying it it makes me happy that you guys are happy so it's a win-win. I do have a Celsius, y'all, but I forgot to put it in the fridge before I started filming, so I had to put it over ice. It's a sparkling watermelon one, and it's delicious because it's like ice cold. <laughs> so cheers to you. Cheers to this video. I'm so excited to be playing today. Let's get into it. Okay, my loves, here we are back in the trout farm. How's everyone doing? Oh, bean. Oh my god. You need a bath so badly. <laughs> um, it looks like Mateo's over here tending to the crops, and it looks like our pumpkins are finally coming through wait they're done wait how come they're not oversized oh our lettuce just flourished prop blah, 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 plopped up while well, taking a break roxanne spice some money is sitting in the sink save it you kidding me 20 bucks um what's happening here what is going on you guys thought it was so funny that he was in love with Patchy. Like, why is everyone in love with Patchy? I will never know. It looks like they're just having some harmless chats about grilled cheese, which is fine. But like, I don't know, man. Really? Oh God, they're freaking flirting. I carumba. Okay, free love is on to be fair. I think I need to turn that off because I also need to turn off the rough housing thing. The two NAPs that I just really don't want. Um, yeah, goodbye also goodbye okay so we'll see if they still flirt with each other after free love is off oh my god patchy is unflirty and yet he initiated some flirts with mateo interesting very interesting how's our eggy doing how are you doing little egg how long until you hatch one day and seven hours all right well when roxanne gets home from school i'm gonna get her to do all of the animal duties because that's like kind of her thing what are you doing? Oh, you're cleaning. Okay, mm, not really. <laughs> I'm just gonna drag these to the dumpster. Thanks though, Patchy, I appreciate it. So we have $1,000. What do I wanna do with the money? Do I want more animals? What do I wanna do? How do I, I wanna make a treat. Ugh, we gotta wait till Roxanne gets back. Come on, Roxanne, hurry, hurry, hurry. She's feeling playful from finding the money. <laughs> Uh, okay, she's back. Hello. All right. No, no best sterling. No, 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 no. Um, refill, clean shed, and then call over bean. I do want to like make a fun treat in this episode too. So I'm gonna figure out how to do that. You poor baby. Oh no, she's unhappy and dirty. Okay, okay. I got you, babes. I got you. Clean bean. Let's um, smother her with love as well. Milk her. You know, everything that we need to do. Look at all the dirt flying out. That's funny. Oh, she got a vitality fertilizer. Love that for us. I know, Bean. I know, I know. A mean streak? Roxanne? I refuse. I refuse to believe it. You better not be mean to this cow. I'll tell you what. I will knock you into frickin' next month. Yeah, now you're happy. Consider ethics of sim fighting. No, let's not. Okay, so I'm interested in... What am I interested in? What's a midnight treat? Try looking at the village shops, vanquish fair competitions, and gifts from critter friends after feeding an animal with a special treat. You'll even learn the recipe. Why is she oh, thinking of fire ants? No, no fire ants. All right, let's just give her a friendly treat and we can, oh, oh, tipping bean gets you enriched milk, $25. Interesting. I kind of want to get a guitar. 24, oh shoot, got to pay bills. I thought we didn't have bills if we lived off the grid. Wow, they just keep flirting. Oh my god, they got what was that? What was that? Hold on, hold on. 
Sheesh. Patchy has a crush on Mateo. Mateo, what have you done? <laughs> What have you done? Yes, you can give your friend, your friend, your unscrupulous friend my number. So, Mateo, I'm gonna need you to pay the bills. Uh, what are they? How much? How much are they? $70. That's not bad at all. All right. So, hey, you, you should probably leave. Ask Megan not to steal. Can we, you want milk? You want, no? Okay. Um, chickies, go in the house. I hear you, I hear you. Oh my god, look, the hen! Herm sleeping on the egg! That is so cute. And some of our crops are ready to be evolved as well, which is fantastic. Are you serious, Roxanne? Are you joking? Dang, our relationship with this bird is not good. How come they're not freaking oversized? I don't know what to do. Oh, we have farmer herbs and veggies. Let's open this up and see what's in there. We also have a vitality fertilizer. I kind of want to use this on our... Can we fertilize? We can't fertilize. Interesting. I'm a little confused on what we need to do. <gasps> what? What? We got a rainbow egg for some reason. Why did we get this? Hold on, I need to look at our notebook. What does this do? Chickens that are very happy have a chance to lay a rainbow egg. Alternatively, feed a hen a rainbow tree, animal tree, and the next egg they lay will be ra rainbow. Used for, used to create the rainbow tree. I'm shook. That's dope. I'm not really sure what to do with it yet, so I'll just hold on to it. I'm gonna put the eggs. No, yes, the eggs and the milk in the fridge. You guys, this is so exciting. I'm confused. What are you scared from? Oh, the rooster pecked you. I'm sorry. Dina Caliente was the unscrupulous friend. That's fair. Oh, right, chocoberry. We don't have a chocoberry plant, I don't think, so we should we should plant one. It's okay, you're fine. The rooster didn't mean any harm. Or did it? Dun, dun, dun! Oh, we got a blue egg, too! What does a blue egg do? I'm blue. If I was green, I would die. I love that little reference there. Feed a hen at fruity treat. And the next egg will be blue. Blue eggs are used to complete certain errands for the grocery owner and grocery delivery villagers. Okay, so we need to hold on to that eggy then. What is this? Why doesn't it tell me? I'm concerned. So, what should we do now? Maybe you should do your homework and then... Let's look at the calendar. What do we got? Geek Con's going on right now. We got Roxanne's birthday in two days. The next thing is the fin Finchwich Cow Fair. I'm kind of interested in going to that, so... Yeah. Oh, everyone's pretty hungry, Mateo. Do you mind co cooking us up some food? Oh, crap. We need to add ice. <gasps> oh, that's something I need to remember to do daily. Power doesn't work off the grid. What do you mean? We have an, a stove right here. Why can't we? Interesting. I'm confused. I'm a little bit confused. Do we need to do something to the stove to make it work? Cook off the grid. Wow, there's really not much that we can make, is there? I guess we're doing forager stew again. Oh, he was tutoring her. That's so cute. All right, meal number two in the house. Let's freaking go enjoy that stew. I have a feeling they're only gonna eat stews and soups for a while. <laughs> Speaking of stews and soups, look. All lime Skittles, baby. Yes, hi, Caleb. Can I help you with something? I'm gonna get him to dive. Oh my God, look at the state of our dumpster. Try to clear roaches. We have roaches? Oh no. Ew, look at this dumpster. That is foul. He burnt his hand and he's now dumpster diving, which he hates. I'm sorry, sir, but this is just, this is, this is the life. Oh no, Roxanne's gonna have her period, shoot. Okay, it looks like we found some stuff. So let's look at our haul and make some money, shall we? $410 for this chair, 500 for this dresser, and then this sink we can probably put inside. It looks like it just needs a good cleaning. All righty then. So, time to head off to bed, and then tomorrow I'm gonna get Mateo to head into town and maybe do like some more errands for the townies, cause apparently that's how you do everything. That's how you get the the livestock upgrade parts, all the good stuff, all the stuff that we need. Okay, we now have a sink inside, which is fantastic. Good morning, Dicky Bird. <laughs> 
<laughs> cock a doodle do baby oh it's a hot day today so we get to see roxanne in her hot weather outfit she's looking good oh <gasps> the egg that was incubated in the coop is ready to hatch have mateo use hatch egg to see the hatching in progress <gasps> get up sir what a monumental day <gasps> what happens if we put a rainbow egg to be hatched they're probably not hatchable are they <gasps> wait wait <gasps> Oh my god. That was so cute. A very heartwarming moment. Oh my goodness. Where's the baby? Oh my god, you guys, our first bunny is he's spotted. Did you come to see the new the new chicken? Hi. Wow, the bunnies are actually so cute. What the heck? Let's tell it a joke. And Anim these animals seem to like jokes. Tell joke about leafy greens. What you think, baby? No. You don't like the joke? But why? Maybe Roxanne will have better luck. <gasps> Look at the baby! Look, he's so cute. Oh, oh my God. This is fantastic. I love this. Ooh, let's give it a flower. Let's give it a, um, a daisy and see if it likes it. We don't have a very good relationship with this bunny right now. I'm so sorry, Bun Bun. Here though, do you like a uh, flower? Oh. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, maybe let's try our luck with Roxanne. Discover gift preferences? Why can we do that? Is it because she's an animal enthusiast? What do you like? What do you like? Oh, he left. Sad day. Okay, bye, bunny. Who are you? Waste manager? Uh oh. Is our dumpster like in a really bad state? It looks fine. What what are you here for? What's wrong? What happened? Is it because we're Oh my god! What is happening right now? So confused, you guys. I am so confused. Okay. I don't really know what's happening, but remember to take care of your outdoor trash cans. You were charged $50 for this visit. What? I hate this. What is happening? Why is a chicken in our bathroom? I didn't realize chickens could go into buildings. So for her aspiration, she wants to fertilize three plants. So I'm just gonna get her to do that really quick with these huckleberries. And then she wants to place one wild rabbit home or flock of wild birds on your home lot. Okay, uh, I didn't even realize that we could do that, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the rabbit one. Oh, dang it, it unlocks by befriending a wild rabbit. Okay, that's fair, I understand that. I'm gonna grab another animal shed, I think. We have a decent amount of money. Where do we get all this money from? Oh my God, it takes up so much room. I'm concerned. I'm gonna move the fire over here. Actually, let's move it over here. And then maybe we can have another barn over here. <laughs> such an awkward layout, isn't it? We might need to move into a bigger lot. Yeah, I think we're definitely gonna have to do that. Oh shoot, I forgot to put a uh, walkway. Alrighty, let's purchase a llama since we don't have one. Should we get a white or beige? Hmm. Let's do white. Boom! Llama time! Stop. Llama time. Oh my god, look at you. Uh-huh. 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 Uh, so we're gonna name this baby, uh, what was the name of the llama from Emperor's New Groove? Not Cusco, but the one that Pacha had. What is Pacha's llama's name? Misty! Misty! Oh, okay, yes, this is gonna be Misty, and if we get another llama, we're naming it Tina from freaking Napoleon. Hi, Misty. I love you. We can already shear your wool. Holy cannoli, that was fast. Hi, sweet bean. Are you sus about us? Oh, oh, I'm sorry, baby. 
Okay. Uh -huh. Looks like we have to build relations first, which is fair. I'm so sorry, Misty. Tell jokes about the wool. Yeah, just try to like diffuse the situation by joking around about it. Okay, I think Misty liked that. I didn't realize rainbow eggs could be spoiled. I didn't realize eggs could spoil. What is this mystery meat? I hover over it and you can't do anything to it. I'm really confused. We can't even can off the grid. Is that a glitch? Oh, so I have to click on the stove to do it. Okay. All right. Well, maybe we should do some canning then. This is interesting. So we can do a meat substitute, mushroom conserve, or tomato sauce. Let's do a tomato sauce. I think Roxanne should be the canner in the family. Okay. Oh, Is yeah. this a cooking skill that she's getting? Yeah, it is. Okay, that's fair. My freaking camera, I hate myself. I have my timer going. It won't happen again, I promise. Okay, she cooked it for like, okay, no, she's cooking it some more. Okay, all done. What are you gonna do with it? Oh. Oh, you have to cook it some more? Okay, okay. What, you don't like vegetables? Come on now. What are you saying? Full. Extra jars? <gasps> okay, how much is this worth? It's a real question. $27. Will it go bad? I don't know. I wish we could make glow orb canning stuff. That would be dope. It doesn't look like you can can everything, which is kind of a bummer. Like, you know how you could pretty much juice anything you wanted to? It don't look like you can can everything. What's this? Uh, Self-sustaining from cooking with the simple living lot challenge. Very nice. So I don't know about these, you guys. Are they, is there like a chance that they're gonna be oversized and they just weren't? Is that what I'm getting? From this all right mateo's in a pretty good mood he's about to have a marshmallow but i'm sorry my boy but we have to go to the town we gotta go to the town because we gotta do more uh more tasks to get things there's michael bell michael buble why do you have negative relations with raul oh my goodness oh my gosh you guys it's ghost night and Look who's here. Emily, my stardew Emily. Oh my gosh, we have to introduce ourselves. Oh my God, and freaking Derek's here. The ghost of Derek will forever haunt this pub. What is this pub called again? Who's that? No! No! No, no, no! I gave Sarah a makeover and she's no longer the pub owner. I'm so sad. Oh, oh, here's Shane. Hi, Shane. Oh my gosh, gotta introduce ourselves to him too. Um, okay, I'm so sad right now. That means that the grocery thing probably isn't run by Kim anymore. I made a mistake. So just a heads up. If you click and play on their households, they won't have their jobs anymore, which is such a bummer. So this is the one that I was saying should be with Roxanne. And here's the new creature keeper. And here's that guy again. Jeez, he's everywhere. He's got quite the dumper, huh? Ugh. Dang it. I'm so sad. That is hmm, very unfortunate, but... Whatever. What a waste of time doing those makeovers was. I wonder if there's a way that I can cheat it back. What's up, girl? You got any uh, tasks for me? Let's do this simple request one. Four blueberries. Ugh, why is it always blueberries? There's gossip out there and I don't know what it is. All right. I'll figure it out for you. It drives me mad knowing there's tawdry gossip being exchanged. And let me tell you, my ears are burning. Most of the locals know my face, but perhaps they won't see you coming. Listen in on any gossipers you spot and clue me in on what's being said. Get the gossip. Well, how do I get the gossip? How do I do it? This is so fun. Seeing the Stardew characters here is actually like the game. And of course, Shane and Emily would be here because Shane's the alcoholic and Emily's the bartender. It's quite perfect if you ask me. Let's see what he thinks of Shane. Interesting. Uh, Shane thinks that we're unreliable. That's fair. What about Emily? Uh, independent and capable. And we think she's imaginative. Well, isn't that cute? Who's this that you're talking to? Nolan. There's Sarah! Uh, I'm so pissed off that she's not the pub owner anymore. There's gotta be a way that I could cheat it. Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys that both Roxanne and Mateo both have the outdoorsy 
the outdoorsy lifestyles. If anyone knows of a way to cheat uh, her to be the pub owner, let me know. We have a pretty good relationship with her though, so like we can still be friends with her. Let's ask her about her career and see what she does now. Oh yeah, this is her makeover by the way. God, she's beautiful. I love this outfit too. It's a mood. Hey, where are you going? We want to ask you about your career. Whoa, why is the water spewing out of the back of the sink like that? It's freaking 4 a.m. We came at the wrong time. What's the hot gossip though? Bean blender at the frothy foamer? So she's like a barista now? This is the new grocery shop owner, Abel. You guys, I made a big mistake giving them makeovers. I'm gonna do this creature comforts uh, iron for him. So we need blueberries, we need gossip, and two bottles of white milk. I'm pretty sure we, yeah, we do have milk. So here, take it. I'm no spring chicken. Every day that passes is a day I grow older. I can swear I hear my bones creaking. Would you please be a pal and bring me milk? Of course. Here you go. Here you go, Mr. Sir. I've got the milk for you. Now give me animal treat. I want animal treat. All right, what'd you give me? <gasps> a sweater! A sweater for my cow and a delivery coupon and a livestock upgrade part and a friendly treat. Okay, cool. I mean, you know, I would really like to do another errand for you. Oh, here's, um, what's her face? What's, what's, her, what's her name again? Cecilia? Cecilia, this is her makeover. She's so blown out, but it's okay. Um, what does he want? Collect four grocery orders, deliver a single serving of food to the grocery or or owner, and deliver rose to the creature keeper. That's quite the uh, errand. Oh my god, here's Abigail. Oh, she's so cute. Abigail from Stardew. Hello. Okay, what time does this shop open? Hello? 9 a.m.? Oh my god, that's in freaking three hours. So cute over here, though, you guys. Like, ooh, what happens if we window shop? I'm curious what that looks like. He's feeling tense because there's someone he doesn't like nearby. But window shopping when the short stores are closed, it's pretty perfect. Let's see. Let's see what he does. So he just stands there and looks. I mean, I guess that's what window shopping is, yeah? That bread sure does look good, I will not lie. Got a thing for bread. What can we do here? Plan outfits, change outfits, window shop. We can also window shop here too. That looks like a cute store. Oh, oh, there's Sebastian. Sebastian from Stardew. We're seeing all of them out and about today. Hi, Seb. Gosh, he's beautiful. Oh wait, no, this is the one. This is the one that we said would look really, really cute with Roxanne. Just introduce yourself to him real quick, please. And then, it looks like the stores are open. Let's see what Agnes has today. Hey, Aggie. <laughs> Party treat. Increase your animal's social motive. Okay, we can get one of those so that we know how to make it. Ooh, birds of paradise. That would be nice to have. Here's the blueberries we need four. Custard, oh my God. Do you make that from eggs? Fruity treat, we need to know how to make that. Healthy treat, I wanna know how to make that too. Honestly, you guys, like buying the treats is gonna be my <laughs> my obsession. Cause like, if you know, um, or if you buy a treat, then you learn the recipe for it. Oh, there's Maru! Stardew Maru. Okay, it's just wrapped meat, I guess. Okay, let's go ahead and deliver these blueberries to the uh, pub owner and then go home for a little while. He's really not feeling good. Oh no, the fangs are here. Yikes. Oh, there's one of your guys' Sims. Mickey, I think. Yeah, oh my God, she's so cute. Why is everyone so flirty? Every single person that comes to this bar is flirty. Here are your blueberries. You're welcome. I miss Sarah. Okay, okay, what'd we get, what'd we get? Pumpkin stew, some cheese. Aw, well thank you. All right, all right, let's go home. Let's go home so you can take care of yourself. Make sure Roxanne is studying hard. Whew, what an eventful day in town today, I'll tell you what. And you guys don't even know how sad I am. The freaking OG people from this pack aren't at their jobs anymore. I need to figure out a way to fix it. So if you know, let me know, because I just 
gave them makeovers for no reason at all. He has a sore from chores from cleaning while off the grid. What is this one from? Spit shine and elbow grease from cleaning while off the grid. I've never seen a sim have a negative and positive moodlet from the same thing. Hi, chicky. Why are you in the house? I don't think you're allowed in there, but okay. You, you do what you gotta do. Okay, welcome back, Roxanne. I'm, I'm gonna have to get you a moodlet solver because, um... Your mood is trash and there's like a lot that needs to be done. So go ahead and drink it. And let's take care of the animals, shall we? This llama hates us. We just tried to shower it with love and it did not like it. Do you, do you maybe want to see our dance moves perhaps? Oh look, our trees sprouted. When did we plant a lemon tree? I don't remember doing that, but okay. All right, let's see if Misty likes dances cause <laughs> I don't know what to do. Do you like? <gasps> Misty likes our dances. Will you take our love smothers now? Oh, you will. Thank you so much. <laughs> Misty needs a bath. Good llama. Good Misty. Are we growing on you? Yeah. So I don't think that these are gonna get any bigger. So maybe we should just harvest them, you know? See what we're getting from Patchy's pockets today. Nothing? You've got nothing for us, Patchy? All right. Well, I guess let's harvest, um, harvest. I guess just harvest all. I really hope I'm not doing the right, wrong thing here. Let's get some more, some more, uh, more crop seeds. Oh, I forgot the little baby chick needs a name as well. <gasps> oh no, another chicken name. Do we get any hatchable eggs today? <laughs> yep, we did. All right, let's pop this in here. So Mateo has, oh my gosh, look, it's Elliot. Hi, Elliot. This is another Stardew character. Let's give him a friendly introduction. Hey there, can I help you? This is the trout farm. Uh-oh, what's that fire Samba. ant? Hold on. So Roxanne thinks that he's clingy, huh? Interesting. Oh. Oh. What, what's the matter? What does he think about us? <gasps> Distant? That's like, uh, two very opposite ends of the spectrum. Clingy and distant. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh-oh. Oh no, she's dizzy. Caleb, why are you here again? I don't understand. I don't really want her to get her period because it sucks. So we're just gonna put her on birth control for now. Bond with flies? Oh no, there's flies? Oh my God, okay. Uh, empty trash. I don't know where it goes, but okay, there's, there's, right. Celebrity level lost. I mean, that's okay. That we expected that to happen. Oh God, please don't die by flies. I'm a little bit concerned. How do we get rid of the trash? Do we have to recycle it? Okay, I'm gonna buy a recycle machine cause I don't, I've never done this before and I'm very confused. The outdoor trash is no longer bottomless. So what am I supposed to do? 845, you're kidding me. That is so much money. We're probably, I mean, we probably need it though. We also found some things in the dumpster too that we can sell. Uh, this is 230, thank goodness. And this is 330. Wow. Yeah, selling that for sure. Okay, so, hey Mateo, can I have all of these treats please? Since Roxanne's the animal lover, I'm gonna give her the treats and her she can be in charge of them. You also have some fertilizer, so could you fertilize these? We also have some seed packets to open, which is super exciting. We got bluebells, grapes, holly, and basil. Boring. Wow. Since he has a higher cooking skill, he can can a lot more than Roxanne can. Oh my god, let's make some custard. That sounds so good. Okay, so she emptied the trash. I'm gonna put it in our inventory. And then I think we need to just bring it over here and recycle it. Yeah, that seems to be the way to do it. Oh, oh, Mateo finished the custard. <gasps> Custard, how much is it worth though? Is it worth more than the tomato sauce? No, it's not, interesting. Okay. I wanna put this sweater on the cow, so I'm gonna get Roxanne to do it. She's super angry about these roaches, how annoying. All right, Bean, I'm gonna need you to come out. Come out, Bean, I have something for I you. Yee! Okay, uh, dress Bean. 
please don't hate me for this. <gasps> I think she likes it. I'm so glad. I'm so glad, Bebby. Do you want a treat? What kind of treat do you want? What should we do? Veggie treat gives you plant milk. Fruity treat gets you enriched milk. Friend, uh, animal party treat, social, oh. healthy treat, animal lifespan. I love you, Bean. Okay, so you have to feed them the treat to get the uh, to get the recipe. Good night, Bean. Enjoy your sweater, my love. Look at the baby chicky. Uh, it's too cute. It's a rooster. It's a rooster chick. You guys know. No, not the dreaded crop glitch. There is a way to fix it, but it's just very annoying. <gasps> the bunny's back. The bunny's back and you're gonna be in trouble. Hey, ya, hey, ya, the bunny's back. What'd you get from Patchy? More blackberry. I don't want blackberries. I want something new. <gasps> Hi, Bun Buns. Let's give it a gift. Give canned good. Uh, how about some custard? You like custard? Oh, there you go. Do you like it? You don't like the custard? What a waste. What a waste of custard. Oh, you can't give it more than one gift in a day? Wow. Okay, so they're trying to make it hard for us, I see. Oh crap, it's Roxanne's birthday today. Okay, okay, uh, what should we do? Should we celebrate it at the pub? I don't know what to do otherwise. I think that could be fun. I wonder if you can order a cake at the pub. Okay, I'm gonna sell some of these crops that we have in here because honestly, pff, we really don't need 44 parsleys. I'm having him make some milk bread. It's one of the only things that we can cook. <laughs> Oh, that looks great, sir. Oh, that looks really yummy. Oh, he got the people person lifestyle as well. Wasn't well, that sweet? Okay, you're still hungry. So I guess have another slice of this. I just want them to be in a decent mood for tonight because they are going to go to the pub and have a nice time for Roxanne's birthday. Hopefully, oh, the bunny's back. Hopefully, um, there will be a place to, to make a cake. I'm so annoyed. I, I put her on birth control because I didn't want her to have her period, but she got it anyways. <sighs> okay. All right. Let's travel. Let's go. It's 10 p.m., which I guess isn't too late. That's pretty much the time that people go out. Uh, so let's just go. Let's go. Let's bring Elliot. Let's bring Mateo, Celia, Summer, Tatum, whatever. Everyone that we know, except for our mom. <laughs> I I don't know who I want Roxanne to be with. It's such a tough decision. I was thinking Raul, the gro the grocery store boy, because uh, you guys were saying that his backstory is that he wants to be a city boy, like he wants to move to the city. Ooh, and it's ladies' night tonight. So I think it would be funny if like he dated her to try to get to Mateo and try to get like Mateo to tell him about the city and like all that kind of stuff. Um, but let's give her her nice outfit for her birthday. Um, let's do this one. Super cute. I think everyone thinks Cecilia is naked. I think the shorts might be broken. <laughs> oh, it takes three days before birth control takes effect. All right. Well, that makes sense. Oh, there is a kitchen here. Okay, fantastic. So I'm going to get her to use a tampon and then I'm going to need you to make a cake for her, please. It's like it's dark, but it's not really dark. It's kind of weird. Yo, what's up, girl? How can I help you, Gabriella? I'm just making a cake for my sister. Don't mind me. All right. There you go. A nice cake. I'm going to put it right here. Hopefully she can blow out the candles with it right there. Oh my gosh, there's Maru. Introduce yourself. And Emily. Yes, the gang's all here, baby. Oh, there's another one of y'all Sims. This is Raven Sim, I think. She's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Yo, it's your birthday. You need to calm down. Make some friends, please. I know that you're quite the loner, but the last time you were here, you were like chatting it up with everybody. And these girls are so cute. It would be very nice if they could be your friend. How do you feel about it? What are your first impressions of them? 
You think Emily is interesting and she thinks you're independent and capable. Well, isn't that sweet? How do you feel about Maru? Oh no, she thinks Maru's annoying and Maru thinks Roxanne is distant. Yikes. All right. Well, looks like Emily is <laughs> gonna be easier to get along with. We'll see. She's like, yeah, I'm just here to celebrate my birthday. Let's, let's get her a drink. Let's have, why can't she order? Roxanne is not eligible? Why? She's a lady. She's a lady and ladies shouldn't be messed with. <laughs> let's get her, let's get her a lot of colada. Oh no, she's feeling tense. What is this? Stranger danger from loner trait. It's okay, Roxanne. Please just try to enjoy your birthday. There's, there's Seb. Oh my gosh. Um, shoot, this is gonna be really hard because she is a loner and like trying to get her to make friends is gonna be increasingly difficult. Okay, I'm just gonna cheat her energy because I just, just her being tired is such a buzz kill. What is really, Mag oh, Magnolia, you're a, you're a notable newcomer as well. Hmm. Do you want to be our bestie? Yes, girl, enjoy that colada. She's going upstairs. She's got some liquid courage. She's going to introduce herself. Did you see? He totally gave her the side eye. Uh-oh. Oh, there's Haley. Ah, another Stardew, you guys. This is so fun, seeing all the Stardew characters here at the pub because it's just like the freaking game. I'm obsessed. Get away from him, Haley. That is not your man, okay? He is not your type. I know that for a fact. Okay, I think she's a little tipsy. Oh God, what happened? Uh oh, she did an impression and they didn't like it. Sit with us. Oh, oh yes. No, he's he was gonna sit with us, but now he's, is he leaving? Oh gosh. What does he think about us, I wonder? Distant. It's that loner trait. <gasps> she do Oh my gosh, look! She's got a crush on him! And she thinks he's interesting. <gasps> we need to give him his job. He's a hacker, so I gotta give him the programmer job. Oh my gosh, okay. So how was that drink? How are you feeling? She's in a crowded bar. She's just upstairs watching TV by herself. <sighs> it's not exactly crowded, is it? <laughs> All right, well, I guess we should get her to come over here, make a wish. Oh, here's Kim with her makeover. Ah, oh, she looks great. I wish she was still the grocery shop owner. Okay, here she comes. Mateo, come celebrate. Come celebrate. Celebrate good times. Come on. Happiest of birthdays, my little love. She said, this is all I wanted. I just wanted it to be us two. Oh. She's like celebrating from across the bar. That's actually really cute. Okay. Okay. So her third trait. Should I randomize it? I'm kind of intrigued to see what we get. Y'all know I love a good randomization. If I don't like it, I'll change it. But let's just see. Bookworm, that's cute. All right, bookworm it is. Happy birthday, Roxanne. We love you so, 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 so much. Do you have anything that you can gift her? Can we order? Okay, we can purchase gifts because we're at the bar. Okay, maybe we should get her um, a book, A Game of Groans. <laughs> that's pretty good. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna get her Game of Groans, AKA Game of Thrones. Let's go ahead and give her a birthday gift. I hope you like it. You are a bookworm after all. I got you something. Wow, thank you, Mateo. Hello. <gasps> thank you so much. You know I love books. Whoa, what's the bartender doing over there? Relax, ma'am. You're gonna, she's like, I'm fine. It's cool. It's just a little fiery mistake. <laughs> I don't know what the heck is going on here. My game is like pissed off at me. 
It's very mad. Here's uh, that one guy, Thomas. I gave him a little makeover too, but he's just, I just don't like him very much. So yeah. Oh, the freaking eyeball ring. Yep to me. Oh, he showed us. God, I hate you so much. <laughs> oh my gosh, cake. Is it good? Are you having fun? Oh my gosh, it's almost six in the morning. There is so much stuff that we can cook not off the grid it makes me kind of sad but at least we can always come here to cook something if we need to so yeah that's good to know all right you two well let's head home <gasps> there's carrie sim welcome home y'all oh man my game is pissed at me holy cannoli oh wow how am i gonna play like this Oh, thank goodness she doesn't have to go to school anymore. So our relationship with Bean is almost completely full, which is very exciting. Let's tip her. Oh my, what the heck? What? That was not $25. That was a lot of dollars. Holy cannoli. Oh, I get it. You get enriched, enriched milk by tipping Bean. Wow, that's... That's pretty funny. Whoa, Shane's here? What's good, dude? You feel free to come in if you like. The chicken is in the house again. Ooh, Roxanne's a close-knit lifestyle. That's cute. Feel free to have some milk bread, Shane. All right, guys. I think I'm gonna have to cut this episode a little short because my game is, like, broken. I can't... I can't do anything. It's very weird. I think I need to, like see because i did update my mods before i filmed today but i guess that was like the wrong move because it just seems more broken than it is last time unfortunately i might just have to play without mods for a little while i'm okay with that though like this let's play doesn't really need mods that that much um except for like the personality ones but so in the next episode what do we want to do just do more errands i guess get more we i really want to participate in the fairs like that's something that uh, we haven't done, but like, we have like a whole week until the cow fair. And then the llama fair is two weeks after that. So it takes, it, wait, what? There's a festival today. <gasps> Garden competition, pie competition, purchase unique items and win ribbons. Wait a minute, we gotta do that. Okay, I, I'm still gonna end this episode right here. And in the next one, we will participate in this fair today. I don't know if we're going to like, Garden competition. Submit your healthiest, happiest plants. Okay, so we can participate. Do we have anything that's like really good? We've got some perfect quality small watermelons and lettuce and aubergines and mushrooms and pumpkins. We've also got nice glow orbs. Yeah, I can't even switch between them. It's kind of crazy. I just need to take the mods out and then um, film another episode i'll probably film right after this actually because i really want to participate in the fair <laughs> i love you guys so so much thank you for watching this episode i hope you enjoyed it and i will see you in the next one for the garden fair also i really would like seb and roxanne to go on a date i think it's so cute that she has a little crush on him so maybe they i can place like a cute like cottage living restaurant downtown or i can place like or they can go on a picnic, maybe, because that's a new thing. That would be really cute. So we'll probably do that in the next one. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye!